Chapter 5 The Lipan Apache Tribe The Lipan Apaches lived in the Plains Culture Region, an area we now call the Great Plains. The Great Plains were large areas of land covered with grass. Many animals ate the grasses off the Great Plains, like buffaloes, rabbits, deer, elk, sheep, wild turkeys, and prairie chickens. They all lived in the prairies of Texas. The Lipan Apaches were great hunters. They traveled the Great Plains hunting for all these animals, but especially the buffalo. Some Lipan Apaches lived in round, dome-shaped huts. These were made from small branches and covered with brush. When it was cold, they were also covered with buffalo hides. These huts were called wikiups. They were temporary huts because the Lipan Apache were nomadic and followed the buffalo as the herds migrated in the spring and the fall. Some Lipan Apaches lived in light but sturdy teepees that were easy to put together and take apart and carry from place to place. Some teepees were small, just for three or four people, but some were large enough that a dozen people could fit in them. The teepee frame was made by tying together long poles. Then, the frame was wrapped with buffalo hides. The door always faced the east, towards the rising sun. The Lipana Pashi considered the sun an important god. The Lipan Apaches were skillful hunter-gatherers, and they also grew some crops. Lipan men did almost all of the hunting. They hunted many animals like buffalo, deer, turkeys, bears, fish, and even grasshoppers. But. Hunting buffalo was most important because it was their main food source. Lipan Apache women knew what plants grew around their camps and which ones were good for eating. They gathered foods such as cactus, wild onions, grapes, and nuts. Lepan women also took care of small gardens 
where they planted corn, squash, beans, and the pumpkins. Lipanapashis lived together in large families. Several families would live close to each other and travel together. These larger groups of families were called bands. The most respected man in a band served as the chief. The chief organized large activities like buffalo hunts and moving the camp. The Lepans also had a head woman who was in charge when the men were gone. The head woman was usually the wife of the chief. The Lepanapashis worshipped the sun and the moon as their two most important gods. After many years of studying this sky, the Lepanapashis learned to predict eclipses. They believed that eclipses were a meeting of their two most important gods, and they would celebrate with large ceremonies when an eclipse occurred. 